Hello students, welcome to Soros Our Classes. For detailed information about our classes, you can visit our website that is www.sorosourclasses.com and for other doubts and queries, you can just call us or WhatsApp us at this number 9836-793076. You can even like our videos and subscribe our channel for further more videos. Today we are discussing some questions on general physics and our first question is the period of oscillation of a simple pendulum is t is equals to 2 pi root over l by g measured value of l is equals to 20 centimeter known to 1 millimeter accuracy and time for 100 oscillations for the pendulum is found to be 90 second using a wristwatch of 1 second resolution. The oscillation of the pendulum is found to be 90 second. The accuracy in the determination of G is and the options are option A 3%, option B 2%, option C 1% and option D 5%. So now let's proceed to the solution. We know that time period that is T is equals to small t by N. And it is also given that t is equals to 2 pi root over l by g. We can write it as g is equals to 4 pi square into l divided by t square is equals to 4 pi square into L divided by T by N whole square. We are putting the value of T that is equals to T small T by N here. And by simplifying this we can get T is equals to 4 pi square N square into L by T square. So the percentage error, the percentage error in the value of G will be del G by G into 100 is equals to del L by L into 100 plus 2 into del t by t into 100. We can simplify this and rewrite the value by putting the values that is given in the question as 0 0.1 divided by 20 the value of del n and l and del t and t was given in the question when we are just putting the value here into 100 plus 2 into 1 by 90 as t was given 90 second into 100 and by simplifying this we can write the value as 2.72 percent so here the percentage error in the value of G will be 2.72% and this is our answer. Here is our next question and the question is a wire has a mass 0 0.3 plus minus 0 0.03 gram radius that is 0 0.5 plus minus 0 0.05 millimeter and length that is 6 plus minus 0 0.06 centimeter the maximum percentage error the maximum percentage error in the measurement of its density is and the options are option a that is 1 option b 2 option c that is 3 and option b that is d so now let's proceed to the solution we know that the density that is rho is equals to m by pi r square l here it is given that mass that is m is equals to 0 0.3 plus minus 0 0.03 gram 
radius that is r is equals to 0 0.5 plus minus 0 0.005 millimeter and length that is L is equals to 6 plus minus 0 0.06 centimeter here coming back to this formula we can write it as del rho by rho into 100 is equals to del m by m into plus 2 into del r by r plus del l by l into 100 even we can write it as del m by m into 100 plus 2 into del r by r into 100 plus del l by l into 100 and by putting the value of m r and l we can get the answer that is 4 percent so here the maximum percentage error here the maximum percentage error that is asked in the question in the measurement of its density is 4% so here option D that is 4 is the correct answer now the next question is a cube has a side of length 1.2 into 10 to the power minus 2 meter it is the length of the cube calculate its volume and here four options are given so now let's proceed to the solution here it is asked to calculate the volume so we can write that volume V is equals to length cube that is 1.2 into 10 to the power minus 2 as the value of L was given in the question so we are just putting the value in this formula so V is equals to cube root of this is equals to 1.728 into 10 to the power minus 6 meter cube we can even write the meter here so as length L has two significant figures as length that is L has two significant significant figures the volume that is V will also have two significant figures two significant figures therefore the correct answer is is v is equals to 1.7 into 10 to the power minus 6 meter cube that is option a so here option a is the correct answer